Meg sobs as lean and air names Timothy Chalamet instead has as face of men's blurred a Chanel fragrance. Timothy Chalamet has been unveiled as the newest Chanel ambassador for its blurred a Chanel fragrance for men. The French luxury house confirmed the news 27-year-old Call Me By Your Name star will appear in his first ad campaign in June shot by Italian-American photographer Mario Sorrenti. This will be followed by the release of a campaign film directed by Martin Scorsese in the autumn. Meghan Markle was so envious of another Hollywood actress who outperformed Prince Harry, her husband, whom she views as a famous royal, that she felt the Duke should represent well-known companies. Prince Harry's request to be the newest ambassador for men's Bleu de Chanel fragrance was denied, according to Lena Nair, CEO of Chanel. The possibility of the Sussex couple being shunned in France increased as a result of the three minutes, 35 seconds long film that journalist Julian Duponchel shared on his Twitter page regarding the report on the Archul Foundation that was shown in France on April 13, 2023. Because Meghan and Prince Harry have always sought to benefit independently, all French businesses are likely to distance themselves from them as a result of realizing they're two-faced. An earlier source said that Meghan Markle and Kylie Jenner, Timothy's current girlfriend, were pals. However, after learning that Meghan Markle had built their friendship grave by routinely using her private plane without paying the use charge, Kylie Jenner ended their relationship. Although the Marklesses' net worth were an order of magnitude greater than what is reported they would have more than $5 million of equity in their $15 million home, they would pony up the $6,500 an hour for a NetJet's subscription, and they would not need to joyride on Oprah or Tyler's jet. I conservatively choose not to believe that they really are bilking Oprah or Tyler for the immediate luxury of private jet travel because that would put so many millions more in future endorsements and deals in Meghan's mind at risk. Additionally, Kylie Jenner reportedly declined to sell her previous Los Angeles property to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle in the past, resulting in a feud between the two celebrities. A move to LA was on the cards for Meghan Markle and Prince Harry after claims made by Caitlyn Jenner that the royal couple was looking for a house in Los Angeles. The Keeping Up with Kardashians star, 70, told British talk show Loose Women that she had heard they were looking for a house in the beach city of Malibu, which was later revealed to be one particular house, an eight-bedroom European-style mansion in a gated community that was once, briefly, home to the biggest influencer of them all, Kylie Jenner. Variety reported Jenner rented the house for about two weeks over summer in 2018. The property is still listed as available to rent for nearly $10,000 a night, that's $15,000. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex originally announced they would split their time between the UK and Canada but then ex-royal couple has chosen to end up in LA. Buying the Malibu house would place them only 30 miles from Meghan's mother, Doria Ragland, as well as Hollywood. This isn't the first property the couple has been revealed as eyeing off. The Sussexes spent six weeks renting a $14 million home on Vancouver Island after news of their split from the royal family broke and were reportedly on the hunt for a dream home while they were there, zeroing in on a $40 million waterfront trophy home. Serving as the actor's first collaboration with Chanel, as well as his first official ambassadorship of any fashion or beauty label, Chalamet follows in the footsteps of fellow Hollywood star Brad Pitt who also acts as an ambassador for the brand. Speaking to Dazed Digital, Timothy says of his new role, I didn't have to sell myself on anything when I was asked to become the new ambassador of Bleu de Chanel. The decision was not dissimilar to agreeing to do a film. I am lucky to be at a place in my career where I have the opportunity to curate and choose projects that strike my passion. When so many fingers in the glove feel like they fit, it becomes a no-brainer. Whilst a spokesperson from Chanel said the Dune star was chosen for his audacious style and unapologetic charm and the exemplary way he is able to personify the vision and edgy spirit of the next chapter of the Bleu de Chanel fragrance. Next cha
Greg sobs as lean and air names Timothy Chalamet instead has as face of men's blurred a Chanel fragrance. Timothy Chalamet has been unveiled as the newest Chanel ambassador for its Bleu de Chanel fragrance for men. The French luxury house confirmed the news 27-year-old Call Me By Your Name star will appear in his first ad campaign in June shot by Italian-American photographer Mario Sorrenti. This will be followed by the release of a campaign film directed by Martin Scorsese 